Welcome to day 3 of 4 days of empties. Today, I'll talk about skincare products. First, we've got here micellar waters. These two are from the French brand Sobio Ethic, and I can assure you I love them both. One is targeted to give you a hydrating sensation and the other one has a purifying effect. But to be honest, I didn't notice a huge difference between both of them. This is Pacifica's Cactus Water. I found it to be a little bit drying on my skin and it gave me a kind of tingling sensation afterwards. For that reason, I didn't like it too much. However, I remember it removed my makeup pretty well. Now here I have Yes to Tomatoes Detoxifying Charcoal Micellar Water. Guys, I use this every day after coming back from the gym and it really helped me keeping my pores clean, unclogged. You can get it from the drugstore and it's very affordable. Moving on to facial cleansers, here I've got a bottle of Youth to the People's Kale, Green Tea and Spinach Cleanser. I've said this before, I love it and I will keep getting more of these because it's clean and it doesn't dry out my skin. And this one is a mini of Grown Alchemist's Geranium Leaf Facial Cleanser. I am totally biased with this brand, guys, because it is one of my favorite clean green beauty brands, you know. Now, this is a cleanser that you love if you have acne or problematic skin. This is Dr. Broner's Tea Tree Cleanser, and I only use this during that time of the month, you know what I mean, when my skin tends to get more oily and causes me breakouts. The only downside of this product is that it can be quite drying, therefore I'd suggest to use it only a few times a week. Moving on to toners and mists. This one is by far my favorite out of all. This is the Thayer's Witch Hazel Rose Petal Toner. And the very first times that I used it, I understood why everyone loves it. Because it leaves my skin feeling plumped, hydrated. And even though it feels like a luxurious product, it is very affordable. This one could be like the high-end version of the past one. This is the Herbivore's Rose Hibiscus Coconut Water. And this one is more expensive than the last one, but I still prefer the other one. Those two products are great if you have dry to normal skin, but this one is perfect if you have an oily T-zone. This is from Ren Skincare and this is their Clarimat Toner. And to be fair guys, I only used this on my T-zone and it lasted for ages, I loved it. And this one is from the Mexican brand Samania, also really good to control oiliness or you can apply it on a cyst directly and it works and the magic here is practically the tea tree oil you know this is made out of tea tree oil and that is pretty used to control cystic acne i have two moisturizers to talk about this one is from the brand juice beauty and this is from their stem cellular collection it's meant to prevent wrinkles or diminish them and to be honest i saw a difference guys so yeah i would definitely get it again I mean, I'm 28, it's not like I have a lot of wrinkles, but I definitely have premature wrinkles, you know, and I saw a difference on those. Once again, I am totally biased with this product because it is from Cores, and it just reminds me of the two times that I've been to Greece, you know, I bought this on my second trip and I loved it. it the smell, guys, the fragrance is insane and it is so hydrating. It's perfect for the summer. And what I mean by that is because of its gel-like texture, you know, it's kind of a creamy gel, something in between. Now, this is from the brand Glossier. It's supposed to be a moisturizing primer. I didn't like it. I think it did nothing for my skin. And my honest opinion, if you have dry skin, stay away from this. Oils. I love oils. And this one is amazing, guys. I need to get the bigger version. I mean, the full-size version. This is from the brand Herbivore. It's their lapis oil. Ah, I love it. If you have combination skin, you will definitely see a lot of difference on your oil production and also I noticed difference on my hyperpigmentation issues. This one is from Pi Skincare and once again guys, if you have dry skin, I would totally recommend you this brand and also Grown Alchemist. You may ask, why? Well, they both contain natural ingredients and they are just so gentle on the skin. This product in particular is so good for hyperpigmentation issues. Now to wrap up this video, I have a night treatment. This is from the brand Cores. 
This is supposed to diminish your dark circles, but I just noticed hydration, you know, like uh, normal hydration, nothing special. I much prefer my Biosense eye treatment. That one works. That one really diminishes your dark circles. Finally, a blemish treatment from the brand Juice Beauty. Guys, this is insane. It works so well overnight. I mean, I have right now the Tata Harper blemish treatment or something like that. This one is much better and much cheaper. Get it if you can. Alright you guys, I hope that you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up and I'll see you tomorrow for day 4 of empties. Bye!